Hey Steve, welcome back to Ori and the Blind, whatever the fuck. This is part three, I think. Where is we're on? We're in it for the long haul. I'm here with. Kevin. All right, hurry up! We got 15 seconds. Russia just <laughs> invaded the Crimea <laughs> region with boobies, 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 boobies. <laughs> there, I think we kept them. <laughs> yes, right. I didn't learn my lesson at the first 15 seconds, but uh, yeah, we got yeah, it. We yeah, yeah. Whoa! I got a map right. Here. Yeah. I like oh, I like nice. to get as much done in 15 seconds as I can. I mean that's <laughs> really my goal. Yeah, it's um. I should I say ask your wife that or something? I don't know. I'm trying to think of some joke, but it just. It's yeah, so I mean. <laughs> oh shit! Ah, uh, there oh, you shit. go. Oh shit! Crazy. Uh, so I just got the ability in the last video to um, run up walls. Um, so he can kind of infinitely climb a wall if it's a flat surface without thorns on it. If that makes sense. Where the hell is that map? Oh, I don't even remember. Um, so I like, yeah. I like how this game starts out with you being, um, you know, this vulnerable creature. Thing, it's like, and then you just get awoken. This, yeah. 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 And then, then, then you're like, I'm gonna take a nap, and then I'm gonna shoot laser beams at everything. <laughs> like, <laughs> it sounds pretty logical to me. <laughs> uh, yeah. I mean. I feel like this is the kind of thing that happens when you have a team of people all over the place and developing oh. it separately. And like, it's almost like, like someone that is the writes, case. yeah, yeah, someone writes some of the story, and they're like, "That sounds great. Let's start there." I was handed over to the developers to so put some gameplay together, and uh -huh. then like one of the developers gets this idea, like, "You know, it'd be sweet if instead of this guy like running from everything, we change the <laughs> gameplay mechanic so that he has a laser beam." <laughs> I have to press X to shoot the lasers. It's it's a game. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. definitely it's Actually, a game, but like... So there's one really cool thing. So you'll see me in a second. I create a um, little pillar of light, and you do that by... You have mana. So I have mana and health. My green, The green balls are the health, and blue is mana. All right, so effectively what it is is a quick save. So they built into this game quick saving as like a thing, um, but you need... To have mana, enough mana to cast a quick save, which is kind of neat. So, you know, because like most people, like a lot of people who, especially if you emulate a game or something, you're playing a console game, you know, you're always going to quick save, right? Oh shit, this mm -hmm. is hard. But they built it into the game. I think it's just kind of neat how, you, like, quick save is a spell you cast. Um, so you can you can save anywhere, but you're limited, you know, based on how much mana you have at the moment. And I died. I should, probably should have quick save there as I'm saying that. <laughs> yeah. It's like, there's this really great feature where if you save Where's, some mana, you Yeah, can and then I just totally like, you. don't oh! even do it. Yeah. <laughs> it's classic. And, oh I, my and God. I was gonna say that, yeah, you know, well, like sometimes you probably can't twitch and respond in time, but I yeah. think you just jumped your I, face into something you got hit, hit by like six times previous. Yeah. It was yeah. Like, yeah. I'm face checking this damage yeah. meter. Yeah. <laughs> yep. This thing does one. Yeah. Green they even blob they even gave they even give me it. mana right before this freaking section, which is like even more pathetic. Well, I don't have double jump yet. You get double jump later on. I've, I've played about like two hours of this. Um, that's about it. But it's it's freaking good. It's it gets really hard really fast, as you might have noticed already. I mean, this is this is kind of difficult. Maybe he doesn't yeah. look that way, but oh my god! You know, oh, I I, yeah. I have a general desire mm -hmm. to, pl to to interact with things that are always hard. Like <laughs> I Same. I don't need any other texture other than just really hard. You you left some health down there. It's actually quite a yeah, lot. Yeah, yeah. Well, I don't I don't need it. There's more health up here. Yay! Yay! I'm pretty. Oh god. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> okay, I'm pretty apparently sure I, I didn't need it. You do need help. Yes, you were right. <laughs> oh, this is already turning out to be it. This is why we don't do live playthroughs. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Well, it's you know, entertaining. This, pro uh, th this provides our viewer with an opportunity to decide if they want us to do live playthroughs or not. You know, we yeah. could alternatively just like record all this in, in advance and. After yeah. you know two to six months, we yeah. could release a video where Adam's you know competent. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't die. Just, so. just Steve, leave a comment in the comments. Steve, let us know what your Steve's thoughts are. Yeah. In and, the Steve section below. In the, in the Steve section below. Uh, there'll be. I'll put a little uh, link for the Steve section. 
Mm. You know, I've always wondered though, like, you know, I know that he watches these videos from time to uh, time. Yeah, but I don't think all of them. I mean, they're, in his defense, they're incredibly boring, especially my StarCraft ones. But mostly I watch those. They just do that for me. Yeah, anyway. and for that one study. But, yeah. um... <laughs> yeah. But, um... What I wonder about is, does Steve go to like the library or somewhere that has like an internet connection to do that, or um, how is he able to watch a video? <laughs> that's a very good point. Apparently, I'm lacking the key. Um, yes, that's a good point. DSL, it's, so it's high speed. They tell him it's high speed. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. I guess. I love how they just straight up lie about that. Didn't and the recent FCC ruling was like um. It's like high speed requires 30, right? Or 20? Like it was not the yeah. 5 that AT&T and like Frontier and all the Verizon sometimes give you. Well, the Verizon's no, 5 like there... now, but I mean, they, they were doing DSL for a while. Yeah, there there was a requirement, like like they were actually saying that, you know, peak speeds of 5 were like considered hi, like well, high, high speed. speed like... Which is a freaking joke. <laughs> like they, they didn't even actually have to sell you 5, um, Five mm -hmm. down, which like five down will get you done. It's not great, but well, like, it'll it'll it, check you know, email and browse the web, which is what ninety nine percent of Americans do, I think. Well, may maybe less than ninety nine, but you know, like a majority of people. Like back when right, Comcast got mad at me for like using two hundred gig a month or three hundred gig a month, whatever we were using, they were like, "Well, what are you uh, doing?" And I was like, "Well, fucking six people live in this house, and we watch Netflix and stream and play MMOs at the same time." <laughs> you know. And he's, oh, he's the... like, and he's like, well, 99% uh, of our customers use less than 2 gig a month. And I'm like... So you are the 1%. Yeah. <laughs> In a way that I don't want to be. Sure, yeah. Yeah. If we get a cutscene, um, by the way, it's going to be a sweet cutscene. Yeah, I can see that. There's like this throbbing tree of pleasure. And it's <laughs> in the middle of this sea of blue mist. Oh, yeah. And, and then there's like... Oh, at first I thought that that was some winged like monster with claws for balls, but then it turns out it's a bird. Ball um, claws? That would be a yeah, serious ball claws. Pokemon right there. Yeah. Also makes the claw game a lot more graphic at like your local Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> Dude, Chuck E. Cheese still exists, and I'm kind of surprised. You know, I really wish they changed their marketing scheme from like kids. To like full well, grown ass adults. They got and then, like, Dave and Busters. Boobies. I mean, that's what Dave and Busters is. And that, that works because they have like alcohol and steaks and stuff and video games. So that's why they're awesome. Yeah. But yeah. There's still a Chuck E. Cheese out on Castleton right off 82nd Street. You nice. know what? Poor kids need birthday parties too. <laughs> like, <laughs> dude, I bet it's not. I bet it's expensive. And no our idea. one viewer just left. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come back. Leave a comment in Steve's section. <laughs> Leave a Steve in yeah. the Steve's section. We'll just call everything Steve's. Yeah, I feel like the... The... Mm -hmm. Non-delineating manner of that... Or nature of that particular noun might cause some problems for people. I mean, I'm not saying we shouldn't Steve it. I'm just saying, <laughs> oh, now it's a verb too, right? <laughs> what do we do? Press X to save your That's game. Right. Yes, I will do that for sure. Right, but, right now we're just trying to get people to click away anyway. So okay. I, I forgot yeah, go straight to PewDiePie. <laughs> you need to stop saying his first. name because we need to. Nobody needs to acknowledge his existence anymore. Um, anyway. Why not? Like I like I I like to elevate the one percent. That's why I don't oh, okay. vote and like yeah. pay my taxes. You know, it's like. <laughs> yeah, good point. Oh my I god, like, what do I even do here? Right, Speaking of one percent, ah. yeah, you oh, know that's, that's one of the uh, components of the new FCC rules or whatever on um, net neutrality. Which is what? Is that um, um, they they can't um, they can't um, deny you access to websites or content. Yeah. Well, it so, was in so like, the UN voted internet access like a universal human right, I believe, a while back. Um, yeah, but the United States only listens to particular right. UN rules that like. Mm -hmm. You know that that are convenient to them. Usually, the ones that they pass, right? Uh, yes. <laughs> they're not, they're, <laughs> That's they're a very not good so point. In, yeah, we are in no way. They're not so interested in them since we created it. Woodrow Wilson's League of Nations. Right. Right. Yeah, I guess. 
That's where it came from. League of Nations 1914, I think you proposed it? Don't you know this? You majored in history. Okay, so that is a ridiculous concept, and I, and I want to like get on top of that now. Okay. Like, no one, no one talks to a doctor, and they're like, um, you know, oh, Wilson like, was a doctor. I, I, oh shit! I, I don't <laughs> like. I've got cancer. Like, you know, what do you know about like, um, you know, liver failure? And it's like, well, liver fa failure related to cancer? No, like related to something completely different. I don't know about that because I'm a cancer doctor. Like, yeah. Well, what? Aren't you a history? Well, well what about Didn't physics? You know this? What, yeah. what about physics? Don't you know this? Like, it's like, no, I'm a history major. That doesn't mean I know all of the history of the world. Like, unfortunately, that's not really what history majoring is about. It's about mm -hmm. basically being a literature critic, but like for things that actually happen as opposed to things people fake happening. Okay. Next time, With Kevin lectures us on history. We're gonna be expecting a full, <laughs> full report. Right, Did we go over ten minutes?